it's cold and windy today, so we're going to need something to pick up our spirits. And for me, the easiest way to make me feel a little bit more comfortable is to eat. Cooking outdoors is often associated with game, but it's not the easiest thing to get the kids involved with. You can't always convince them that a nice partridge breast is going to be as good as a marshmallow. So let's see if we can find something that everyone will enjoy. Everybody likes dessert, so today we're going to turn this banana into a delicious campfire treat. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our fixed blade knife and we're just going to run it all the way down inside the banana skin without puncturing this side. So we've got like a banana taco. So next up, we've got some chocolate buttons. You can't go wrong with these. All we're gonna do now, we're gonna take these chocolate buttons and we're gonna stuff them inside our banana. Earlier I mentioned that this were like a treat for the kids, but I'd be lying if I said I didn't absolutely adore it myself. Our next step is to take these tiny marshmallows and place those again inside our little banana boat. Up next, all we're going to do is wrap our banana boat in tin foil, double layer, because this is going to go directly into the flames. You can see we've got a nice bed of embers and ashes there, so we're just going to take our banana boat, bob it there, and we're going to leave it there 10 15 minutes. Now, I realize I'm out here doing this cooking on an open fire, but there's no reason that you can't replicate this at home in the oven or you know. The weather's picking up a little bit, we're coming into spring, get that barbecue out, if you've got a little fire pit, chimney, wang it in there, see what happens. Okay, so now it's time to take it out. I'm going to use these two sticks to manoeuvre it out and put it on this plate behind me until it is cool. Okay, so in here now, hopefully, is a beautiful, caramelised, chocolatey, marshmallowy, banana good time. Whoa, yes. So all we've got left to do now is tuck in. Super, super little washing up. The banana itself is going to hold, the banana skin is going to hold all the contents. Look at that. I don't even particularly like bananas, but I think these are delicious. Now I've used chocolate and marshmallows in this, but you can play around with all kinds of different fillings, toppings. You're only really limited by your imagination, or I suppose your tastes, depending on what you like or don't like, but give it a go, let us know what you think.